So we are back with more Persona 5 Royale. I am sleepy as crap, but the show must go on. So last episode we did Futaba's Palace. Yeah, we did that. We did some social linking. And we gotta continue with it, but off camera I did some bullshit, so now we have. Huh? So, yeah, off camera we end up getting, what is it, Bianco, Thunderbird's just broken, Hellbiker, Daishobu, what is it, yeah, so there's them, Messiah and them I just did for, just using for literally no reason, but I need Judgment Arcana, so why not. Actually, let me just drop them from my roster at the moment, because I don't really use them. Get rid of you, and get rid of you. I'm also doing that before I get comments about how I'm quote-unquote using DLC to break the game. When, honestly, I'm not even doing that. These are the paths you have walked. But I know I'm gonna get those comments because it's literally all people do nowadays. So, let's get back to my usual shit, so... Is this what you want? You always draw this and accept you, I this need... persona. This persona? Not these two. A fee is this is you. your power. Why am I going? Oh, I am like on the wrong list. Holy crap! And you cannot afford this. Of course, I can't get my freaking King Frost or my Melzadek. Oh, I can't get my Melzadek back. Word. Let's go. All right, so they're back. Done already. What? And now we can go and hang out with Mishima, who I think I have a persona for. I don't really know, and I kind of don't care, actually. Uh, where is... What is this arcana again? Mishima, Mishima, the moon arcana, so... Well, somebody already told me Mishima doesn't require, uh... Wow, this is amazing! I, somebody did tell me, yeah, you don't need a persona for Mishima, because he'll rank up regardless of what you do. I think, what is it, rank up uh, the more you get into certain things. Or the more requests you do for him. Yeah, so you remember those guys who beat up Akiyama? Well, it turns out they really were dangerous. So I looked them up and I got some seriously scary info. Apparently they were part of a, uh, they're part of a gang that's involved in extortion uh, extortion stuff like that all the time. I wish I had known that going in. Once I put the tongue and uh, in the act that I pulled, and I would have been dead. Eesh. Shows real courage. Hmm? God, I do not like hanging out with Mishima, but whatever. Honestly, though, you're amazing. You aren't afraid of being you're afraid of the slightest. Maybe it's only natural, uh, the nightmares you've been through. Yo, Mishima! Hey. Uh, hi there. Wow, it really is Mishima. Dude, right? Nobody else could be this boring. Hey, you figured out what you're gonna do in high school? It's just... Uh, not yet. How about the military? Because nobody would know, notice Zero like you stealthing around. <laughs> true. Alright, too true. I bet you could sneak in anywhere. You'd be Japan's ultimate weapon. I mean, they're technically not wrong, I guess. Ah, shut up. Akiyama. What, something wrong? Or, uh, not, not exactly. Come on, let's just forget them. It's no fun messing with Mishima anymore. What do you mean, no fun? You're always the one screwing with him the most. I don't know. I just got tired of it. Hey, Bob before. I've been thinking, well, I should probably thank you. Huh? Something happened between you two? You know you have you have been acting weird lately, Akiyama. I don't think I ever noticed all those bruises you've got. I... No, no. 
it before. I don't really know what you're talking about. Mishima. My bad. Guess it was someone else. You've changed, though. Hmm? Not enough to be a good character, but whatever. Yo, glasses. I've seen you two together. You've been coaching him? Exactly. Yeah, so that's so. I'm kinda jealous. Anyway, see you later. Holy shit, I'm tired as hell. Wait up, Akiyama. Where? <laughs> it looks like Ak Akiyama's gonna be just fine. He's a pretty strong willed guy. And I've really changed, huh? Do you think maybe now I start. Uh, I, I'm starting to be like the Phantom Thieves. All right. I'm gonna work even harder to make sure. Uh, wait, didn't he give us a? Uh... Huh. So. All right. Huh? Um. I thought we had a, a mementos request for Mishima. Oh wait, we already did go into mementos technically. Could have sworn we had a mentos request from Mishima. All right. But I guess not. <laughs> See you. Yeah. Oh. Unless I'm like thinking wrong, maybe I don't know. More Mishima had a mementos request. I don't know why this game is bothering to do the whole Hey, you get some points with him, I'm like nothing I can do is gonna really change much on him. Because Mishima is trash and will always be trash. Because that character is just, no. Like, why? I get what they were trying to do, but, like, come on, man. Uh, who else is it? So, we got Takemi available, and we got Makoto. So, I guess we'll hang out with Makoto, I guess. Because we kind of need to. See, all we can do is wait. Wait, do I have a persona with her? Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. I have Kurohime. Yeah, 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 yeah. Well. Well. It feels like I, don't, I just don't know what to do. Any or, yeah, I can't talk. What the fuck? Uh, it feels like I just don't know anything anymore. Uh, let's talk about. Let's talk more about in the student council room. We can get in through the back entrance. Swear to kill. Okay. Yeah, so my class had a practice exam. Let's see, practice entrance exam, and my score is significantly lower than last time, and I'm concerned. It's a thief work. Uh, I can't talk today, apparently. No, I'm sure I set aside the appropriate amount of time to study. The truth is, recently I started questioning my entire, the entire point of my education. What am I to gain from getting good grades and living up to high expectations my sister set out for me? I spoke to Aiko in, about the matter as well, but the answer hasn't come any clearer. Aiko? Hmm? You don't remember Aiko? You don't remember? Uh, you don't remember? Aiko Takao. Or Takao. I keep calling her Takao for some unholy reason, but whatever. Um, let's see. I asked her about the job that she has at the salon in Shinjuku. Uh, let's see. Anyways, we've been calling each other every so often, so we exchange contact information. Uh, because of those calls, we actually grown close somewhat. Uh, when I voiced my concerns to her, she asked me how I would benefit from going to a top university. But I could I couldn't come up with a good answer. As for Aiko, her grades are not the best, but she claims that she doesn't even think about that stuff. Apparently, her parents can choose or can use her, their connections to find her a job. 
<sighs> but isn't that a little irresponsible? It's nice she can rely on her parents, but this is her life, not theirs. I guess it's they're just eh. I guess it's just a different way of approaching things. Even at that, her vision of the future is still clearer than mine. Don't you have goals? <sighs> I used to think that doing what others expected of me was the best way forward. And I was going in a, I was going to major in law, just to, like my sister had. And after that, I would, I would simply have handed, uh, headed down whatever path society had made for me. But, but everything changed when I joined the Phantom Thieves. And I realized, uh, oh my lord, I cannot read today. Apparently. Uh, I realize now that there are more important things to life than being a prim and proper honor student. Honestly, let's see. Yep. You know, I really wish they did change Makoto's uh, social link to focus more on Never this mind. instead of her friend being a hoe. Like, let's be completely honest here. Like, they could have changed Makoto's social link so it's less about Eiko and more about, you know, her. You're right. Cause like it seems like every little thing is always about um Thank you very it's much. always about Makoto's friend and not her herself. Like she brings up her dad, but that never goes anywhere. Then we talk about like Aiko and we spend like an entire fucking arc on it. I'm just like All right. why? I don't know if that's just me, but it gets kind of annoying when it's just, hey, let's talk about Aiko again. And I'm like, can we not, please? Because it's like every time it's fucking Aiko. Ah, you're back. Nice. Well, who's available today? Uh, oh, yeah, is apparently. Kawakami isn't available, and neither is Miss Frontier. Uh, airsoft shop. Where have you been? Been searching all. I don't give a fuck. Hmm. Okay. Uh, let's just sell I this. That's fine. And then. I guess sell this. Since I can just reforge the personas that I use to uh, make the dang thing, so why not? And instead of hanging out with Oh yeah, because I kind of don't want to now, uh, I may as well Come do on. this. Come on. Okay, I am lost here. Could have sworn. Hold on. Hmm. All right. Oh, I think these are just items you're just supposed to sell, I guess. Grateful. I guess that's fine. You should be grateful. I guess that's fine. Okay, sounds good. Mm -hmm. Why not? 
Even though Yusuke is more likely going to get uh, benched from my team at this point. Uh, come again. Uh... Yeah, let's just go to the temple. Oh, right, they only do it in the mornings, right. Forgot about that little tidbit. <sighs> you would think this would be the time when, like, a catchy or something is around, but he's not, because the game hates me. Welcome! What do you play? What do you want to do? Thank you! It's just never gonna so go up. Fun. All right then. I guess I gotta go and get the other cue board or a cue pole just so I can um just so I can actually do that trick shot. for the lovers are kind of no hey yeah let's see oh look at the ducks over there they must be a family this place is seriously amazing or seriously feels amazing it's not even that far from shibuya but it feels so different here literally just because it's more out into the forest area and not you know whatever you know tokyo is so strange there are tons of people and tons of stores yet there are still duck-filled parks here. It has everything, but it feels like I can't understand any of it, and it's honestly scary. I know what you mean. Oh, right. You just you only just moved here. Hey. When I first got here, I had a super tough time adjusting. It was so crowded, everyone walked really fast, and it was almost like they were angry or something. Even at school, I... I was only ever the foreigner. Nobody nobody really knew me, so they just spread rumors. And I thought maybe my looks were the problem, and I even considered dyeing my hair black just to match everyone else. But that's when Shiho talked to me, and the first thing she said was, uh, Takamaki, uh, er, <laughs> God, they got me saying Takamaki, or uh, Takamaki. I guess, let's just go with Takamaki, I don't fucking care right now. Takamaki, your paintings suck. Uh, was she right? And she definitely was not. Mm. I hope it sunk, but at least I ended up getting a D in art, though. I wonder why. Still, that was the first time somebody talked to me without mentioning my looks. <laughs> We sort of just grew closer after that, and she has been my best friend since. Uh, but that's not why we're here, though. There's something else I need to talk to you about. Hey. Do you remember when I told you the last time we, or what I told you the last time we came here, about the female thief from that a in the anime that I used to watch? Well, I thought of something. Uh, tell me. Well, it's gonna knock your socks off. Uh, coming from you on, it probably won't. So you know how, uh, you know how villains in these shows are always, uh, going on about world domination? Uh, even though they, uh, they get beaten by the heroes every time, they never give up. And that means they have really solid hearts. And that's why I'm going to try and learn from them. Uh, good idea. Right? So I've decided. 
I'm gonna star in action movies. Good luck with that. Ah, thanks for your support. <laughs> Wait, thanks. Your support really helps. Oh boy. We, we say hello to Yukari 2.0, but a better personality. And minus the dead dad thing. Alright, I'm gonna make this my ultimate goal in the future. You know, I've ne uh, what is it? I've never really thought about how, uh, never thought, uh, much about what I wanted to do in life. But now I have an objective. And that really helped, uh, and that only helped because, uh, because of talking to you, Takumi. Thanks! I can sense heightened motivation from on. Because this game fucking hates me. Ah! Oh, hi, sexy technique. The chance to grab an enemy's attention to cancel their action. All right. Which is broke. I, I don't know how that's going to work in application. Mm. Well, if I wanted to be in action movies, I need to work on my actions. And I wonder how many slip ups I've had to do. Wait, Reed just said he knows a good gym. Should I just ask him for advice? Oh, yeah. Oh, and I need to go tell Shiho that I have a new goal. And she'll definitely be happy, happy to hear about it. Come on, let's head home. Come on, let's jump to station. Lord have mercy. Dealing with on is like, I don't know. There, there's a special level of annoying. You know, I'm not surprised On bought that, but whatever. Also, where is Morgana, actually? Like, I get Morgana's not not part of these, uh, these social links, but, like, it's so weird nowadays when he's, like, not around. Rain, huh? Let me see. She... Nope. She cannot be ranked up today. Where have you been? Uh, let's just do the mega... B uh, the Big Bang Burger today. Where have I been? And that's that. Ah. Uh. Um... Let's just do the challenge already. Thank you very much. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Final mission. I gotta do this. Yep. <laughs> Please tell me to increase my... I hate, I hate this back. game sometimes. Why? Why? <laughs> Why won't you increase my freaking guts already? Ah! Ah, who's available? Takemi, so... Actually, what is On's new confidant abilities? Crocodile Tears. Chance to force enemies to ask for less during negotiation. What? Okay, uh, that's interesting. I still need to max out Maruki before November, because, yeah, people keep re reminding me, and oh boy do I love being reminded, that uh, Maruki leaves uh, in November. So I gotta take care of that. Which, yeah, he's like main priority once I get, once the school opens back up, so, E. Uh, uh, hold on. Sorry about that, guys. On YouTube, we're back. 
So, Takemi's death. Uchi's. Uh, Alright, I need a death or counter persona. Actually, no, 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 no. You know what we're gonna do? We're, you know what we're gonna do? Uh, not this shit. So, yeah, let's get the fuck out of here. Uh, we need to do a thing, especially since we're getting Futaba in a bit. So, what we need to do is go to the underground mall. Alright, shopping. What would you like? I need to Yeah, so bionutrients. Fuck it, I don't care. But we also need to work here. Yeah, let's just work. Cause what you cause the main thing about this place though is that um I appreciate it. Oh god, here we go. Small, let's see, small flowers with soft coloration. Hold on, let me... So, soft... Oh, that's it? Oh, I thought we were going to have more than that. So let's see, so the request is small flowers with soft coloration. That means white or light colors. Alright, so we need a small white flower. Soft coloration. I guess you could say this one too. And then get a small what orange flower. Hopefully this works. Amazing. Nah, that actually oh, fucking worked. I did. Bitch, you better give me extension on that shit. You did great. Yeah, yeah. Uh, Sunday, you okay, man? Also, please yes. tell me my... <laughs> please tell me my kindness increased. Why? Why the fuck is it... Okay, that's actually annoying. Wanna head back? Like, that's one the one thing that bothers me. Um... About this is like, why the fuck? Well then. Let's see. So, how's Futaba? I'm worried about her. Dude, uh, that is, this isn't some normal stuff, uh, no more oversleeping stuff. The deadline's tomorrow. And if Futaba's not up by then, but can she really do anything even if she wakes up? I'm honestly not sure. Either way, our only option is to put our trust in her. That's right. Yeah. If she's been asleep for all this time, don't you think she's having some kind of long dream? Well, the dreams are said to be a, sor a sorting of memories, after all. She surely needs ample time to face her troubled path. Her past? You think she's really facing all that shit right now? If that is the case, she would probably need a great amount of time to do so. And considering how she had us wrapped around her finger. I feel as though she'll be able to pull this off. Eh, I'll believe in Potava. Yes, indeed. I have to agree with Makoto. Who knows how this might turn out? 
True, but I know how things play it out because I played the original game. So, who's available right now? Longer speech today, shogi practice. Um, how close am I to finishing this fucker's confidant? The prosecutor, man of the people. I'm like, mm, where's Hifumi at? Fuck it, Hifumi time. Because we'll have time uh, later in the game, so it's. Mm, no, we need Kawakami as fast as fucking possible, so... Yeah, so also, uh, I ended up confirming this, because I had to double-check it. So, it turns out, uh, Kawakami's social link has been fixed to where you no longer lose contact with Kawakami if you don't max her out, uh, early. Utaba spent two weeks sleeping, which normally could kill a person. Well, I mean, kinda, it can kill a person, but depending on what you're on, uh, you won't die from sleeping for two two weeks. Uh, the atrophy to your body won't be uh, as bad compared to somebody who's been like asleep for like uh, at least like a month or so. All right, let's do this. It's Futaba time. Isn't today our deadline for dealing with Medjed? Utaba's still asleep, too. This won't be good. Hey. What's up? There's something I came to do. Today's the day Wakaba passed. I do this every year. Here, I've got a cup for you, too. Taba reminds me so much of her mother. She's a smart girl. It doesn't just go with the flow, either. Walk about your work and your kid were so fulfilling for you. Why'd you have to die so suddenly? That reminds me. You saw me talking to that prosecutor. I mean, I mean that woman in the suit, right? I remember you were real bothered by it. She might come back. So I guess I should tell you about it. That woman was trying to get information on Wakaba's research out of me. That's what we heard in the palace. You don't need to know what the research was about. Just know there was some trouble around it. Obviously, Wakaba got dragged into that as well. Now, they ruled her death a suicide. But I've got my doubts. Doubts? Could she have been killed? Supposedly, there were people who wanted to take her research and use it for their own benefit. Sounds about right. Don't get me wrong, though. I don't have a lick of evidence. That's why I haven't told Futaba any of this. I don't want to cause her any more trouble. It sounded like she had suspicions of her own based on what she said in the palace. Still, there's one thing I regret. It was right before Wakaba died. She told me, I think I might die. I brushed it off, thinking it was just a joke. But if I had just taken her seriously... <sighs> that's another reason I took Futaba in. Redemption. She went through such horrible things. Those heartless adults just yelled at the poor girl. Hey, how do you heal emotional scars? I don't know. But <laughs> honestly, I got my own demons I'm dealing with as well. So uh, that's that was actually the one question Sojiro I think asked in the original game that hit me. Because here's my thing: emotional scars heal for multitudes of ways. There's no real set way of doing it. For me, I got some shit in my closet. I still don't really want to go and face immediately. So it's like you know. I got, I got some shit, basically. 
and I don't know how to take care of that shit, but thanks to basically being around some fuckers on my Discord and whatnot, being friends with some fuckers, I've been able to manage, but Futaba's case, I have no fucking clue. Like, Futaba? That's still a diesel ass outfit, by the way. It's cold. Uh, huh? You can't sell this. N never mind that. But uh, how did you get here? Uh, I walked. You're okay? Was that bad? Th that's not it. I'm just shocked to see you out of the house. Uh. I'm sorry I worried you. <laughs> oh, <laughs> so it's your old best dad. I don't give a f what. Okay, side note, little, little little thing about Atlas, or at least Persona. I don't understand this. What is Atlas's deal w recently, with specifically Persona Four and Five, with making dad characters assholes, but fucking bros by the end of the game, or even middle of the fucking game? Like, it was fucking um. Nanako and her dad, and then, yeah, Dojima, yeah, 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 Dojima, and Nanako, whatever, and that whole situation, um, and now this game's fucking Futaba, like, goddamn. It's alright. By the way, what's the date today? Uh, it's, uh, it's the 21st. I feel like I'm forgetting something. Medjed. Oh, that's it. I didn't just forget that. Let's take care of it now. Come. Come get some of this lolly pussy. Oh, okay. Wow. Uh, that is getting edited out. Okay. Side note, Futaba doesn't really count as a lolly, I guess? Because the term lolly gets thrown around so fucking often, but I'm like, that's... Futaba's about the same age as the main character, so it's like, what? It's my turn to help out. <laughs> Medjed. Now how do we cook them? Eliminate them. <laughs> Violent much? Hey Futaba, we don't have much time left. Are you sure you could do this? The, the kitty talked? Is this a dream? I'm going back to sleep. It is not a dream! Get up! Say something! I'll explain later. R right. Now hurry it up! Eh, I guess it doesn't matter. Let's get cracking. You're just tapping away over there. Are you sure this will work? Mm -hmm. Hey, Futaba! <laughs> I don't think she can hear me. Talk about intense concentration. This place is so messy. I'm surprised she could focus at all. Utaba, you should really clean your room a bit. Huh. She's not listening. Oh well. Just waiting around is boring. Let's clean the place up. This dirty ass room. I mean, her room's no better than mine, but still. Oh. It looks a little better now, don't you think? Well, Futaba, we're done on our end. Are you finished yet? <laughs> she can't hear a word I'm saying. <sighs> Guess we'll just have to keep waiting. <sighs> I'm done! <sighs> What's up? Something happened? It's finished. Finished? What is? <gasps> it's so clean. Why? We cleaned it. Anyway, is it true? Did you really take care of Medjed? I handled them, and someone else handled my room. I don't understand, but this is good. Futaba? Hey, Futaba, what's wrong? She's sleeping. Well, it looks like it's been taken care of. I guess we should get home and sleep too. 
No, fucking A. We clean. Ramen did all the work, Morgana. You right? So Futaba's away. Awesome. And that match has been, and has uh has match been taken care of, or more importantly, how is Futaba doing? She's back to sleep. Seriously? She must have been quite exhausted. I can't say I blame her at all. If Medjit's been affected, it will surely make uh, will surely make the news. That, sh that should be enough to confirm whether or not the deed's been done. Then why don't we all uh, watch the news together? Unless we should meet up at LeBlanc as usual. See you, see you tomorrow, guys. We should be in the clear now, right? We ask, where have I been? I'm a shapeshifter. What do you okay? So I'm probably just gonna make some. Uh, what is it? I might just make some vanish balls because I haven't made yeah. these in a minute. I'll just do it with myself. I could just ask Kawakami to do. Mm -hmm. I, son of a bitch! I just realized yes. I should have just asked Kawakami to make curry for me. Oh, look, all that proficiency yes. that I already have. Wow, look at all that proficiency that I already fucking have. And I need to increase my kindness because this game fucking hates me and thinks that I can't hang out with Futaba because, ah, 